So Brigitte definitely needs some buffs. I've been fighting her for a little bit. She is really fun to fight. She just isn't as strong as other people. I'll be waiting if you want to try again. I, I think, well, I think so a close? lot of people think she needs some buffs. She's got a few ideas on what to do. For one of my buffs out here, I thought I'd just give them up. You know, to see how bad or good people think they are. One. Oh. See ya. One thing I would like to think about you. doing is like maybe now. buffing the duration of Inspired. Because right now, a lot of maps, Brigitte has to rely on rocket trailer. Because you can't really do this on a lot of maps. Unless they're they like the Genji or DPS or, or, or something. That'll go up close and allow you to hit them every so often. So I think maybe like one second extra wouldn't, wouldn't be too great, but it also wouldn't be like underwhelming. Another thing, maybe just maybe too bad by one second. Like, not a minute, but like maybe buff because it's it, her main movement. Granted, she doesn't really need it. I think the one second of entire duration might be just enough. But right now she's kind of she's fun. I wouldn't say she's good, but she's fun. She's definitely like fun. At least where I am. I'm not the best player in the world. I'm average actually. Or the new average with the silver. So yeah, but I think maybe like one second of inspire and maybe a four second shield back. Or maybe even two seconds, but make it not proc inspired. So you have to like, you know, you have to like go in with it, you know, start hitting stuff, you know, all that jazz, and then you can escape, like right there. You would be able to escape, and you'd run back with inspired. And hopefully with the increased stuff, it would not do that. But yeah, so you just have to make it not proc inspired, because, uh, let me show you. Let's see. It does proc inspire, which isn't a huge radius, by the way. But still. Her ult is fine. I honestly forget what it does half the time. But yeah. That's basically it. Yeah. She's more. It's more. I don't think she's underpowered, more so that she's outclassed by every other support. That's what I think the problem is. She's just outclassed by every single so cuticle, cleanse, she's, Well, she's got good healing, good cleanse, good damage, good range as well. Go through, does through walls and everything, you know? But, Lucio has speed boost. Lucio has speed boost and everything. Um... Anna has sleep and anti heal slash over heal. Like, hold on, let me show you. Let me show you what I mean by that over heal. I think you, I think people know what I mean. Well, let's just go in here. See, Anna has you know over heal and uh, sleep, but and anti heal. But Kiriko does counter her, so she's not in the meta from what I hear, because Kiriko is hard meta because of the Suzu and stuff and that ult. She also has nano and stuff. I win. Did not do that. Leave a broken world behind. Look, I haven't. Well, I don't play one more kitty. But this doubles healing on teammates. By the way, of you. If you didn't know. See, like, see, this is the normal heal. Well, let this guy get low, and then you can like flash them and okay, it does heal them. But I've got you. It doubles the healing done on you. Nodding off. But with Kiriko in the meta, she's kind of you're powered up. Get in there right now. But she might come back in the meta if Kiryu is nerfed or something. She's very strong. Baptiste has the lamp, the immortality, day, jump boots, and everything. Get into the field. Okay, that. Let's get you all. He has an AOE. Breach does. Breach does. This has direct heal. But he's also quick scan at range, so he's able to deal with. Power. Any pesky enemies out and about, either, you know. And he is extremely strong. 
And his ultimate? Well, I, I use it very slowly. Oh my I'm gonna use that right now. Let them up. But it's, it's a good ult. Right. He feels a knee. He's a very, very strong healer. I said, I, in my opinion. He's like one of the best, in my opinion. Not as good as what Lucio and Kiri bring, but he's probably one of the best. You know, you've got Kiriko, which has I'll find my own path. I'll pretend I didn't has see that. that. You can go through walls. Like, hold on. I'm like, say you. your teammate's in trouble, you go through, you can do them, they're immortal for a little time, and then you, you also have this Double. insane damage. It's a projectile, but it goes straight. Sit but down, please. Any range. I'm here. You can go up. You can go down. Oh, you can climb walls as well. More you know. And well, switch stuff. One seven seconds. You know, but granted. But yeah, that, that Suzu it cleanses and makes the uh, the damage. That's just so strong right now. Oh, not to mention this ult, by Kai the way. Is, uh, Let the Kitsune guide it you! Had, it was nerfed, but it's still <laughs> kind of insane. Double. I'm glad it was nerfed, but it's still insane. But it's hard to articulate my points, especially as a player that's barely. You've got Lucio with. We're here you know, to be heard! He's got his speed boost and everything. Ah. He also can, like, he can also keep momentum off the ground. Ugh. He's got heal, which is strong. But the main thing you get from him is his switches. You know, it's not. He's also got this boot, which can displace, displace enemies, especially off of high grounds. And his ult is very good for like countering ults, you know. <laughs> you want that loud? So, yeah, he's got a lot of utility he provides. Him. In fact, I use him a lot in comp, along with Baptiste. Mercy is a pocket. Worry, That's I'll basically right her whole deal. You. you know, her pistol's really strong now that they lost it. Kidding, I'm I'm kidding. You know, she's got this. She's I'm got damage you. boost. You know, and she's got res. She's got insane movement with this. I'm not the best at it. I'm sorry. Need some assistance? I'm not. I'm not. I'm really not the best at the movement. I'm sorry, but you, you get my point. She's got good movement. Her pistol is not really useful, but she's also got health. She can stay in the air, damage her teammates, and all that stuff. But, yeah, she's got that. Moira! Moira's also kind of weak. Humanity is shattered. Like, she can do good healing. I find the You're broken. But, I don't know, I think she's probably weaker than Bree. Bree. Let's go. You got this. You don't need to aim it. Just try to it. I you cannot escape me. And everything. You've got the game of war, which is pretty insane. You've got Fade, which is... Get out of your free card. You know, all of that. Um, but she is pretty weak too, I'd say. I don't think I think she's another case of out I think she's weak, weak. And you've got Zen, who is all about providing utility and damage and basically for support. I think he embodies support well because it's just like his healing is weak, but what he provides in return is also very strong. Double. Like, just this core board it provides, like, I don't know how much of a debuff, but it is pretty cool, insane. You've also got this high damage primary fire. And this emergency. Oh, shit, somebody was holding me hard, you know? But what is Reedy You know? In comparison. You know? Oh, he's also. I almost forgot to do it. Okay. He's also got quick melee that like the Lucio boot that it knocks the back a touch like that wisdom. but yeah so he's got this which allows that hold on let me show you it against a roadhog so say the roadhog is completely stupid has no healers and doesn't know what the primary uh, secondary fire is doesn't know how to use his weapon like that. 
doesn't know how to use a hook and everything. You know, he's completely stationary like this. You can do this. Like, you can... He took, like, very few shots to get that. But, you know, that's a very dream scenario. And then you've got Brigitte. I can say she down, just does have good shield, but it's so situational. Because with, you know, you, you have to rely mostly on Inspire, because uh, the health packs, which are a good healing, I don't, they don't provide enough and replenish enough. You really have to rely on Inspire, and right now, I just don't think it works. Because a lot of these maps are far range, and you have to rely on the rocket player a lot, which is like 20 meters. The shield is strong though, you can prevent widows, like you can go around corners like, oh hey, oh there's a widow there, and oh, she can't headshot me because I'm better. But yeah, um, so this is 10 meters. Does this not have Inspire? I guess granted, you're probably going to be, you know, hitting me, but still. 10 seconds, it gives an o it gives over health. Which is something. But otherwise, I don't know. Another thing that could be done, besides like increasing fire, would be to. Four seconds. But you could make it like a three second cool for this. For the. War, the what is it called? I'm, I call it the rocket flail. Looking better already. But it doesn't seem like it's needed. So right, here's 20 meters. It's a 20 meter hit, right? You're relying a lot on that. 20 meters is. Huge. That's a lot of mid range, right? And it's just like Inspire does last a little bit, but like, I, I meant to do that. Hold on. It's hard to prove my point if I'm not getting inspired. But like, say you're next to your allies, you're not really Let taking take good advantage you. of it, especially if you're like me and miss every fucking chain flail. That's how you do it. You're mainly taking advantage of your rocket whip now to get inspired. Because getting in and getting out is way too risky. Like, oh, hey, I'm in the enemy team. Oh, they killed me. Right? It's not easy. I just think maybe. I think shield bash. I think the ultimate thing, right? Because both being inspired by one second, you cannot do that along with the shield bash. But honestly. I don't think it's good, me in my me? opinion. I'll lead the way. But I think ultimately the shield bash, a uh, shield bash buff would be good. Because then you can get in, like, oh hey, oh wow, you know? And then you get out, right? You wouldn't be able to get out right now. So, so. You wouldn't be able to get inspired off of it. You would still have to hit people to get inspired. But, you know, very good. Because there's not a lot of scenarios where there's people. You know, up close. Like, hold on, how far is this, right? It's about five, six, seven meters. Yeah, it's about five, six meters. There's not a lot of times die. where you're gonna be Helping within you six meters of an enemy shield. and not die immediately. You know? I think that's one of the issues right now. And there's a lot of map designs, it's just not good. Not good for Brady. So, yeah, so that's my proposed buffs and some reasonings and some dumb blabbering for about how to buff, like, did she keep the overhelm? Oh, you keep the overhelm. I didn't know that. Sorry, sorry. I keep going on random ass hands. Let me help you with that. That's very fucking weird. But, yeah, that's basically my blabberings. Ignore that. But that's basically my blabberings about it, about Brigitte. Maybe how you could buff her or Looking something. My reasoning why she's weak. Why she's mostly outclassed instead of weak design, weak weak design. Like, she's weak. I, I'm not, I'm not going to say she's not weak right now. I think I probably said she wasn't, but like, ignore that, ignore that. I'm stupid, okay? She's Here, weak. For you. She's pretty freaking weak right now. On, but I think... She's not weak because she's fully designed. I think she's weak because everything nice else kind of goes against her. Right? Like, you can't really do much. Here, take this. 
the uh, repair packs, you could also decrease the time it takes to get a repair pack. Because these do give pretty good that. healing. They give healing over time as well. But yeah, those are my proposed buffs for Brigitte. You know, the three I uh, proposed today were like, what, buff inspire by one second? Either buff shield back by one second and keep the inspire proccing, or buff it by two seconds, but lose the inspire proccing. And also maybe, you know, um, repair pack. Repair pack. You could make some action, it's just, I don't think Sometimes you need to I buff the fire if you buff the shield. shield right? You go in like this and stuff, and then boom, yeah, right? You're, you'll be able to get inspired more consistently. I think it would be fun to see Brig be better. I do like playing her, but I'm not going to play her in a comp. I mostly play her in a I don't know. It's just not good. I don't know what else to say, bye.